Hello everyone, this is Jennifer from Junk Journals by Jen, where journaling is about the journey. Have you ever felt stuck when it came time to work in your own journal? Well, I'm back with another episode of Making Memories Mondays. And if you're new here, the thought behind it is to spend some time on Monday working in my personal journal and taking you along for the journey. Now, I have a um, specific idea for today's page, and um, it has to do with my stepson. I'm going to work on this page here today, and this is so cute. I hate to cover it up, but I'm going to. <laughs> I hate to, though. It's adorable, but it says December, and it's February now, so we're going to cover it up. Um my stepson asked me to teach him how to drive and if any of you have ever been through that before I have two grown daughters who survived the ordeal with me and I've done it before and um it's fun it's challenging exciting <laughs> to say the least if you've ever taught a, a teenager how to drive it's uh good times <laughs> So what I'm thinking, I found this really cute picture of a boy um, driving a car. I'm going to cut that out for one thing. Let's do that real quick. I took him to a, um, like a parking lot. And when we first got there, it was very, it was kind of empty, not really. It was like a store parking lot, and one of the main stores had closed down, so there's just some little stores. It wasn't very many cars, but um, he was, you know, driving around the parking lot. We practiced backing up and parking, and then he was driving in circles and, you know, doing all the things you do on somebody's well, it was technically his second um, driving experience. He'd gone with his mom one time before, but he told me that she kept squealing and saying, if, if you go any faster, you're going to flip us over. And I'm like, how fast were you going? And he said, this fast. And I looked down and we were doing five miles an hour. <laughs> I said, that's hilarious. But I know if you've never done it before, it, it's nerve-wracking relinquishing that control to somebody. So I get that. But um, I was very flattered that he trusted me enough to ask me to do that with him. He's 15, so he's got a little time to learn still. And he'll do driver's ed and all that. But anyway, he's driving in a circles, and then all of a sudden... He, um, like, turns the wheel and goes to cross the busy street. And I'm like, oh, my gosh, now we're here, you know, at the intersection to cross the street. And we did. We crossed the street. It wasn't a really busy street. We had to wait for about four cars to go by. And we crossed the street to another parking lot. And I remained very calm and uh, cool and collected, even though I was not. <laughs> Really, I was a little nervous, but I didn't want to freak him out. And then I very calmly told him, hey, let's practice parking. We parked in the spot, and I said, I think that's enough for today. <laughs> and um, that was the end of our journey. He's so excited about it. He talks all the time about what kind of car he's going to get. I guess that's the thing for teenage boys. They're so excited to get a car. I mean, I remember when I got my first car. I was excited, but I think it's different for, maybe for boys, I don't know. He's my first boy. I hope that's the size. I think that's a good size for that page. <laughs> After all that, I hope that's the one I want to use. So, got that. 
And then I've got this paper here that, um, ooh, that's pretty. Let's see. There's that other size, but that one I think was just too big. So we'll set that aside. I've got green paper. And then there's this turquoisey paper here. It looks like a sky to me. And I'm thinking, I don't know how this is going to go, but I was thinking about doing like maybe a sky at the top and some rolling hills at the bottom. And then the car on it. I think that would be cute. So let's cover the top with the sky first. Got that. Okay, and then we'll do, um, I'm thinking of a couple of hills maybe, and if I ink it, maybe it will show up more. Um, let's see. We'll do the straight part on the bottom, and then... Okay, let's ink this real good. So try to delineate the hills before I decide to put that down. And I've got this Lucky Clover ink. Let's see if that shows up. It is a distress ink. I'm getting it all over me. <laughs> I've been enjoying this lovely weather we've been having. It's been in the 60s. which is our normal winter weather here in Houston. Okay, let's see how that looks. That's cute. Okay, yeah, we'll do that. Kind of makes it look more like a hill. And let's glue this down. going to use some Fabri-Tac just because my art glitter glue gives me some hassle sometimes and I haven't prepared it ahead of time so All right, and then I forgot, I wanna take this um, little thing off of here. I'll put it back on when we're done from the other day.
Okay, glue our pills down and let's see. I think I like the little one over the big one. Yeah. So Liam, uh, he's such a good kid. He, um, you know, I've talked to him before, make, about him before, making memories Mondays. But I homeschooled him when he was younger, during COVID for a couple of years, and we got really close. We'd always say we would do homeschooling in my craft room. We'd always say, "What happens in the craft room stays in the craft room." <laughs> That was our little mantra. Let's move that down to cover that white. Let's see if it's... Well, that's okay. We'll leave it there. All right. So we've got that. And... Oh, that is just adorable. I love it. Let's see. I think like right there looks really cute. And I just get this. I just typed in free picture of boy on car, boy driving car. And um, this came up. I printed it off. So I get lots of pictures that way for my junk journal. For my personal journal anyway. I kind of feel like I could use a sun. Maybe um, I've got some yellow paper still from the other day. Am I going a little crazy here? Maybe I am. I just feel like it could use a sun. I've got this punch. It's kind of big. These are stuck in here, stuck like Chuck. Hope you're finding value here today. If you are, please go ahead and hit the like button. I'd really appreciate it if you would. And um, you might not be finding value over me fighting over with the, this uh, hole punch, but what is going on? Oh, I got it here. I know what to do. Put the scissors in there. All right. I think I'll glue that right there. I don't think that's too big. Then we'll trim it off. It's cute.
then I think I'll put, um, let's put the hole back in where the tag goes on the other side. We can do that. I think, I don't know if this will punch through there. Let's see. Okay, that worked. And then I'll put my lightning bolt back on this page. So I love that. So I've got snow, <laughs> rain, and then sunshine. Going through all the stages of the weather, it seems like. There's that. All right. What else can we do to this page? I kind of want to tag to write, you know, what it is. And I've got this paper that coordinated. I was thinking about doing the tag in that. Let's do that. Let me bring out my dye machine. sandwich that and try to, you know what, I'm going to use a little washi tape just to trick if you're trying to hold it straight. And just throw that washi tape away. Okay, perfect. Got a little tag there. Some scraps. All right. Now I need my hole puncher again. My book back. And punch a hole in this, see if I can get it straight and not like the one I did the other day. I'm going to put an eyelid on this and I'm going to do a little white one. Cute. That's so adorable. I love it. Okay, and I'm just going to write on here really quickly. If I don't do it now, I have a hard time getting back to it. So today's the 5th. So yesterday on 
two, four. Took me a month driving. Said I was great. teacher. Okay. Now let's take, um, I've got some strings here. <clears throat> I'm going to tie it on the top here with that. And how about this dark green to go with the ink? I think that'd be perfect. Should I ink that sun? Well, woulda, shoulda, coulda. I could probably do something else with it now. There you have it. There is my page for today. You know what? I'm gonna put some stickers on there with his name. Hold on one second. Let me grab those. I've got these black and white, or these black stickers. I'm just gonna put Liam's name on there so it means a little more And then there. Oh, that just adds a lot to it. I love it. All right, everyone. That's my page for today. Um, take care until next time. I'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Bye.